welcome to another video where we are fresh off the bat of climbing Bluff Knoll. <laughs> Aching. Aching. We are not fresh. Yeah, probably couldn't go for a run at all. But we are still here in Kendon Up. We've still got another couple of days here. We're hoping for some better weather. Um, looking. Throw it around there. It's been raining on and off, and it is raining on and off for the next couple of days, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So we are, yeah, just sort of hunkering down, relaxing, till we get some good weather, until our bodies clear up to go and see Paronga up. Yeah, climb another obstacle. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, on our quiet days where we're just relaxing, um, we've got some little jobs to do, don't we? Mm-hmm. We've got a dump. One of us has got to dump the caravan nastiness. A little bit of shopping and I guess check out Mount Barker. Um, we've been there a couple of times, we just haven't really had a look around or been able to film anything. So I guess we'll get into that. Yep. And then no idea where this episode's gonna go from there, but. Your guess is as good as ours <laughs> right now, basically. We'll keep on doing it. Anyway, let's get into it. Let's get into Mount Barker. See where this goes. Jeez, how much have you weighed? <laughs> A lot. So dumped and well having a look around Mount Barker but um, we're finding it hard there's not a lot of things on wiki camps around this area even down south is there? No nothing really. No which is weird but first stop which is on wiki camps is the Mount Barker I guess rotary lookout right next to this big Eiffel Tower looking thing. Which on a clear day, that'd look pretty good, wouldn't it? With the mountain ranges in the background. Mm -hmm. I definitely feel like these should have come down. Because <laughs> they're blocking the view a bit. They are for you. And for you, you just stood up there. <laughs> but loads of information. Even on what the different mountains are. Bluff Knoll. Tiny. We climbed that. <laughs> <laughs> My legs are feeling it. So they've got a little walking track just off the lookout there no signs or anything so not too sure where it takes us but I'm hoping it takes us out the other side of the the little lookout here and we see what's on the other side oh that looks pretty cool so it does take us out the other side and it looks like they've got a nice big skywalk So that's also pretty cool, standing right in front of this huge tower here. They've actually got some information on it. It was originally opened on the 6th of June 1966 to provide the ABC television service to the area. They've been expanded over the years and now include ABC television, radio, SPS television, DWN, Win 10, Hot FM and various telcos, so pretty much all the free to air. And it has got tower weight 340 tons.
That's pretty cool, 184 metres above ground level. God, imagine climbing that. That is going to do us there on the hill, but this is what the weather's like for pretty much the next couple of days, isn't it? Yeah. And um, yeah, we sort of we could easily get up and keep on moving in the caravan, but we want to see the Paronga ups. Um, so I think we're just going to stick it out. But should we go to a cafe? A winery? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> um, yeah, there's not there's not a lot to do here in Mount Barker. We just sort of having a look around there's nothing on wiki camps there is some art murals to look at which we'll be looking at but they're all outside hopefully they'll die down just yep. go get coffee or something and... we'll go to a winery there is a winery in the middle of the town it's got a nice little cafe have a look in there but yeah miserable weather Go on, stand in it. That's right. Looks a bit too happy for someone who's about to get swooped by a magpie. <laughs> He's very happy, isn't he? So both. I know she's doing it, so she looks scared of that. <laughs> That's nice, that one. Is that the biggest red you've seen? <laughs> Not happy with you? No. Nah. I just feel like that's been to that bakery and had way too many pies. <laughs> that's the biggest redback I've seen. What are we doing here? Getting a coffee and looking at the pie. Yep. We haven't really found out that much information on this. But um, it is a winery, cellar door is open and they've got a little cafe, cafe in here, haven't they? Yeah. So this is going to be us while this miserable weather's here. Get a coffee and a cake. Oh.
Should we sit here? <laughs> right in front of the fire. Righto, that is us done, I guess, here for today in Mount Barker. We'll probably be back in the next couple of days. There's always something from the shops that we need. <laughs> but a good little look around here. Um, quick cuppa and made a plan, you made a plan. I was about to say, have you got the GoPro? <laughs> it's in your hand. <laughs> yeah, made a plan for the next week, so you know what's going on. I've got no idea. Yeah, Esperance by next weekend, I think. Yep, hopefully we've got good weather. But anyway, let's get back to the van. Go from there, really. Go for a nap, Eli. Yeah, I know, I'm going for a nap. And we did pick up some nice Wagyu steaks from the local butcher here, so we're pretty excited for tonight's dinner, aren't we? Yeah, love a steak. Haven't had a steak in a while. I've let's do it. steak since I've been here. Oh. That is tragic. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful weather for a duck. What are you doing? So that's clean. <laughs> Literally nothing else to do but clean, so. It's cleaning afternoon. With me? What are you doing? <laughs> you wanted steak? Do you want some um, steak with that salt? <laughs> <laughs> so we got Wagyu rump from the local butcher here. I think it was 35 bucks, so we're definitely spending big spenders there. But sweet potato fries and broccolini. Hopefully, mm, not bad. if the weather's all right, I can get out there and do it on the barbecue. If not, it's gonna be on the stove in here, but I'm pretty excited for that. We haven't had a steak in a while, have we? Peppercorn sauce as well. Yep, especially Wagyu and peppercorn sauce. Sorry guys. <laughs> We did a little test try on the air fry with these. They haven't come out as crunchy as you because they haven't come out as crunchy as we wanted, but no, they're good. It's all right. Starving. <laughs> now we have caught a break in the rain. Oh, that looks good. Whoa. <laughs> so we got that right. Medium rare. Wagyu rump. Pretty over the moon out. You're pretty impressed, aren't you? Yeah. Haven't had steak in a while. <laughs> but for a rainy day, that turned out bloody beautiful. I'm excited for this. I'm scared. Let's get into it. Another day. <laughs> We're on our, I guess, second day of this video. And um, I had a beautiful dinner last night, steak. We don't often have a steak like that, but that was top notch. Yeah, was really, nice. really nice steak. Um, local from the butcher here in, well, just over the, the road there, Mount Barker. Mm -hmm. But we are heading back into Mount Barker today. We're, well, instead of sitting around here with this rough weather, we're gonna go check out the museum. Yeah, why not? Yep, that's about all we got left to do in Mount Barker and um, Kendon up here. So $5 entry, I believe. Yeah, I think so. That's what Wiki Cab says. Yep. Gives us something to do as well. Yes. Um, what else? That's about it. That's it. The usual stuff. He needs to get milk and stuff. Yep. Back to the shop again. Mm -hmm. Anyway, let's get into today and then uh, go from there. Hopefully over the next couple of days we get some good weather and we can head over to the Peronga Ups. Sounds good. But let's do this. Yeah, let's do it. Back into Mount Bark and maybe the bakery again. Hi. <laughs> <laughs>
Righto, just off the main road, straight into Mount Barker here is the museum. museum. But I feel like they've hidden that sign for a reason. Yeah, there is a sign out the front saying open weekend, so we're not too sure if it's open during the week. It is Friday. <laughs> <laughs> this is all sort of going a bit south. But anyway, it's going to be a nice walk around. There's a lot of stuff on the outside, but we'll try and get to the office and see if it is open. It doesn't look like it. There's not a lot of cars here. No good. No good. Well, that's a bit of a bugger. Ten dollars per person, children under twelve years free, and free yeah, <laughs> only open on the weekends. But that's a bugger. Sort of ruined our plans for today. But I guess we can have a walk around the outside here and have a look at some things. Know what that is? Something that tops that. Whatever comes out. You got this. My hair's up so I can't, sorry. <laughs> Where they've concreted up.
Well, that's pretty much going to do us here at the museum. A um, bit of a shame that it's not open. It's a little bit, a little bit weird that it's only open on the weekends. Yeah, maybe uh, they just can't staff it. Maybe it's just, I don't know, volunteers. Volunteers only or something. Yeah, not too sure, but it looks to be a really nice walk around. Pe peering through the windows looks really interesting. Loads of different stuff on the outside, so we did manage to see some of that. But yeah. anyway, what's going to do us here? It's yeah. about all there is to see in Mount Barker. Um, let's get out of here. Sounds good. Let's do it. Well, I know it's been a bit of a short one, but I think we are going to end this video here. It's starting to get cold out there. But we've had a relaxing afternoon, just kicking back and doing what social doing now, working. working. Trying to make some videos, trying to get something together. Um, I know it's been a bit of a short one, but it's just been not rough, rainy weather. Yeah, not much to do. Yep. And we are preparing for tomorrow which is going to be the next episode, is Paronga up. So our next little walk, but how are your legs? Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Mine are feeling pretty good. Uh, yeah, I'll get over it. I'll be all right. Yep. Um, I was reading reviews earlier, and it was like, um, it's 4.4K of uh, gradual incline. And Beautiful. then at the end, it's like a rock scramble. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I can't do this again. So our legs will probably be knackered again. Yeah. But anyway, that is the next episode. Paronga ups, look forward to that. But anyway, thanks for watching. Um, let's have a little look around Mount, Mount Barker, really. Nice little easy one, short episode. Yep. Anyway, Lovely. we'll see you on the next one. Paronga ups. Paronga up. <laughs> <laughs> See you there guys. See ya. Bye. And before we go, I do want to say a huge thank you to the Travelling Deans. We'll leave their Instagram down below here again. Um, simply because they let us stay here on their block. Mm -hmm. Top notch little block. Um, and giving us the freedom as well to leave the caravan. Yeah. Dump it. Roam around. Yeah. Take the car for little day trips. So yeah, huge thank you to Travelling Deans. Check them out on Instagram below there. That's it. Thanks guys. Okay. Oh, okay. Third time's a charm. <laughs> okay, guys, so we're going to finish this one here. <laughs> Only just started. <laughs> By the time we get to Wineries. Exmouth. Not X-Mouth, X-Mouth.